video I want to show you how to work on a heavy bag but not in a boxing way or a white highway. I want to show you how to work uh, in a street oriented way. Of course the punches are similar from box, they're taken from boxing and from Muay Thai but uh, I want you to work in a way as I said, in a street oriented way, way when uh, your body, your explosion of the body, your punches are uh, much more devastating and uh, they're like every punch must be a knockout punch, okay? Just to tell you, uh, when you start, as if you're a beginner, I prefer you to start with the big boxing gloves, okay? Punching the back. The head punching the heavy back, you start with the heavy bo boxing gloves. When you get used to that, you go to smaller ones, you go to MMA gloves, okay? And when you're used to with the MMA gloves, then you go just with the hand wraps, you wrap it on your hands. I want to explain you now how to wrap the, the on your hands, but then you, you just go with the, you wrap it on your hands and you punch the heavy back. And the last one is uh, with nothing, just with bare hands, you're punching the back. You must train with bare hands or at least just with, with hand wraps uh, because it will straighten your hands. I've seen uh, and I know boxers that are very good in the ring, but on the street they fucked up their hands because they never train with bare fist, okay? So my advice is uh, you start as I said and uh, the moment you feel comfortable you start punching with bare fist, okay? The first exercise as I said, uh, I'll show the, only, the another thing which is very important, the combination, it doesn't have to be very complicated. Every combination which is very complicated has much bigger chances to get uh, fucked on the street, okay? It's better to have simple punches, there is a strong simple punches rather than big and, and complicated combinations, okay? And uh, to show you how to start you, you have to train, when you train on a heavy back, you have to train uh, your power of the punches. If somebody asks me if I have to give just one advice for the street, one advice, I could give a lot of advices, but one advice which is very important, it's learn how to hit fucking hard, okay? That's, that's crucial, okay? So the first, you, what I show you today, you could work it in rounds, okay? I work it in rounds. You could work it two minutes rounds, uh, 30 seconds rest, three minutes rounds, uh, 30 seconds rest. Usually I prefer to work in five minutes rounds with 30, uh, 30 seconds uh, to rest, okay? Uh, the, the reason I train like that it's when you train five minutes in one moment your body get exhausted get tired and in this moment you still learn and teach your muscles and your brain to continue punching stronger okay so the first exercise you do on a heavy bag also uh, it's very important just to mention the power it comes from the hips I, re I, I repeat myself but it's you, you turn your fingers as if you're squeezing a cockroach, okay? You turn your fingers, your fingers turn your hip and your hip turns your shoulder for the punch, okay? This is crucial. So when you start training, don't do it right away very fast. Try to do it slower and step by step pick up the pace, okay? So the first exercise is you're in your leg guard, and you start punching the back, you do separate punches. So you start with the, with the straight punches, the first punch is the left straight punch, and you do one, then you do two fast punches, then you do three fast punches, okay? Then you, sway, you switch and you go with your right one, okay? So you do one, then you do two, then you do three, okay? That teaches you also to do a preemptive strike, and then to do the continuous attack with each punch, okay? So it looks like that, you go Then you switch with the right one
okay? This is straight punches. Then right away, you go for a sucker punch, the same way. You do left once, twice, and three times, then you do with the right one. So it looks like that. You go, and you go with the right one. Okay? Then you go with the hooks to the body, the same way. You go a bit closer to the back and you go. And the right one. Okay? Then you go for uppercuts. Okay? You come here, and you go the same way. You go left, and you go with the right. Okay? Then you go for the elbows, the same way on the heavy back. Left one, you go. with the right one. Okay? And then you go with the knee. Okay? Left leg forward. You go first of all with this one. You could grab the back and you go. And with the right one. Okay, this is the first exercise. The another way it's you do four fast straight punches, then you do four fast sucker punches, boom, 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 boom. Then you do four fast hooks to the body, boom, 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 boom. and then you do four fast uppercuts, boom, 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 boom. Okay. And then you do four fast knee strikes. So you go two, 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 two. Okay? So more or less looks like that. Okay? Try to punch strong, guys. Don't try to punch as fast as possible. The, the, the speed it will come by the time when you're training. So it looks like you do four straight. Okay? So you do four sucker punches. Okay, then you do four hooks. Then you do four knees. Okay, and then you do four uppercuts. Okay, that's the another way, that's another round you could do to straighten up your punches. The another round, okay? You do straight punch with the left one. You do straight punch. You do sucker punch with the left one right away. You go straight, sucker punch after the sucker punch with your right one. You do hook, hook, okay? Then with the right one, you do a sucker punch. With the left one, you do sucker punch and you do a knee, okay? So it looks, I'll show you. So go straight, sucker punch, hook to the body, hook to the body. Sucker punch, sucker punch, and a knee, okay? So it's like that. Go. Okay, next round guys. You do four straight punches, then you do sucker punch, sucker punch, and a knee, okay? So you do left, right, left, right. You do sucker punch, sucker punch, and a knee, okay? So it looks like that. Okay, next round. You do left, right, 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 then you do left sucker punch, then you go closer, you do two elbows and a knee, okay? So it looks like that. You go left, right, sucker punch, elbow, elbow, and a knee, okay? So it looks like that.
okay? Next round. You do two left straights, go left to left. You do a sucker punch with the left one right away. So you do left, left, sucker punch. You do one, two elbows, and you do two and between two and three knees. So after the two elbows, you grab the back, you do one, two, three, okay? So it looks like that. Left, left, sucker punch. Elbow, elbow, push, push, push. Okay, go. Okay, the next round it's uh, you do you go directly with the left sucker punch as if you're talking from a fence position. You go left sucker punch, then you do right away two elbows and a knee. Okay, let's look. Left sucker punch, two elbows, then a knee. Okay, so go. Okay, next round guys. You do left straight, do right sucker punch, you do left sucker punch, you do two elbows, you could do between two and three elbow, elbows always. You could do two elbows and then you do a knee, okay? So it's left straight, right sucker punch, left sucker punch, two elbows and a knee, okay? So it looks like that. You start with the hooks, you're a bit closer to the back, and you do two hooks, you go hook, hook, okay? Then you go left sucker punch, you go right sucker punch, and then you knee, okay? So it's hook, hook, left sucker punch, right sucker punch, and a knee, okay? Like, Okay, next round guys, you do left uppercut, then you do left sucker punch, then you do a right straight punch, right sucker punch, and you do a knee, okay? You could do it in the air if it's not a heavy back, okay? So again, you do uppercut, sucker punch, straight punch, sucker punch, and a knee, okay? It looks like that. Okay, next round, you do hooks, you do two hooks with the left one, you go hook and hook, then you do left elbow, two right elbows and a knee, okay? It's hook, hook, elbow, elbow, elbow and a knee, okay? Like. Okay, next round. It will be, you do a left uppercut, a right straight punch, left sucker punch, right sucker punch, and a knee, okay? You go boom, it comes under the chin, go straight to the face, go sucker punch, go sucker punch, and your knee, okay? Like, ish, 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 ish. Okay, next, it's, uh, you go right sucker punch right away, okay? You do right sucker punch, and then you do hook, hook with the left one, then you go elbow, elbow with the right one, and a right knee, okay? So it's sucker punch, hook, hook, elbow, elbow, and a knee, okay? You talk, you go. Okay, guys, next round. You do left straight, left hook, left sucker punch, right sucker punch, and a knee. Okay, so go.
Okay, another way to train your toughness of the body, your stamina, which is very important for the street fight, and uh, to straighten up your hands, you make it kind of interval, uh, intensive inter intense interval training. What I mean, you put for each punt, you work each punt, sep in each punt separately with non-stop for 30 seconds, then 10 seconds you rest, and then you work another 30, 40 seconds, okay? So what I mean, if you do a straight punches, left and right, okay? You put it for 30 seconds, and another thing is, do, do not punch this way. This doesn't work. It, it won't work you for the street. It will give you a false security. When you work your punches, try to pull your back a bit away from you. And when you start, let's say, your straight punches, you go... Okay, this is the straight punches. Same thing, then you do the sucker punches. You go... Okay, then you do with the hooks the same way. Okay, then you do with the uppercuts. Same way. Go. Okay, then you do with the knee. Same way, grab the back, and you go. Okay, this is my way of teaching, working on a heavy back. Just as a conclusion, I want to tell you a few things. As I said in the beginning, the punches doesn't have to be very complicated. The other thing is when you punch, Try to punch properly with the right accuracy of turning, rolling your hips and your fingers, okay? The another thing which is very important and try to punch with full power, okay? Try to punch with full, for, with full power as if you're really fighting with someone on the street, okay? We're not talking about a competition on the ring when you could allow yourself to train left and left and left and go and punch and move back and forwards. No, on the street is different. On the street, when there is a fight, after you connect the first punch, it has to be you, 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 and again you until you finish the attacker and you go home, okay? And try to punch with full power to straighten up your body, okay? Your hands and everything, every each part of your body, okay? The another thing which is very important, all these drills I show you today, once you do it with your left stand forward, Okay, your left leg forward and do it left and right. Then, when you do one round, let's say, let's say you do a left sucker punch, sucker punch, and a knee. Okay, you do one round like that. Then you switch stance. Okay, all the rounds I showed you today, you have to do it with both of your stance. So you go right and left and sucker punch and sucker punch and a left knee okay it's very it's crucial you must train both parts of your body so if i'm able to throw a, a left straight strong i must be able to throw a right strong from this position okay and all the punches should be the same way you must be able to throw it equally with both of your parts. It's crucial for the street. Otherwise, you're a half fighter and it won't do you good in a really violent confrontation on the street. Not on the ring, but on the street. So you must train all the drills. I repeat myself, you train it 
the way I show you, then you switch stance and you repeat everything with the opposite, with another part of your body. Okay? Thank you for watching. Train safe.